So I have a perfume. I am not a huge perfume person. I actually am not a big smelly person. Like I cannot walk into Bath and Body Works because my nose will go crazy. Um, I don't really like a lot of things from Victoria's Secret in that sense either. And yeah, that's kind of like my deal. So you will never see Bath and Body Works videos. You will never see Yankee Candle videos on my channel because I just don't love super, super strong scents like that. That being said, I would describe my likes in perfume as basically anything from Burberry. <laughs> Burberry has really nice women's perfume in that I love the smell of their men's cologne and it has like this really nice, rich, luxurious, like earthy muskiness to it that they tend to carry over into their women's line so that it's still feminine but not like super flowery or super citrusy or like super super girly and I think that's what I really like about it is that it has a lot of nice deeper muskier undertones that border on kind of that more masculine cologne smell that richer smell but still like have a nice light note of femininity to it so that being said that's the kind of perfume that I like so that's why I really like all of the Burberry perfumes. This is the Burberry body perfume and I will put in the caption all the nice little things that it says online about what kind of notes it has and what it's supposed to smell like because I'm pretty bad at describing smells. Um, but this is the 1.1 fluid ounce size. If you see this in person, the two ounce size is like a scepter. It's like so long and thin, it's kind of goofy. I mean, I can't imagine that standing on anybody's like perfume tray because it would just tip over. It's kind of really goofy. I don't go through perfume that fast either, so like this will last me a long time, no problem. The packaging itself is really pretty. It's this like crystal scepter. This is the mini scepter because this is the 1.1 fluid ounce. It's supposed to be like rose gold kind of detailing here too. Regular old spray bottle. Dun, da, da, da. I will spray it for you. Not that it really matters. <laughs> and yeah, I don't know how to explain scents very well so I apologize. But I do like this scent and compared to all my other Burberry scents, I think this is one of the lightest, more feminine that they have. Burberry Brit Sheer for women is pretty feminine, but it's like feminine sweet. This one is more like light feminine, not tangy, not sour, but definitely not sweet. Like Burberry Brit Sheer is kind of sweet to me. So yeah. I don't know how else to really explain this perfume better, but I will be putting in the caption like the description that they're talking about. I think it's a great perfume. I love anything Burberry. It is more feminine and more light than their like regular Burberry perfume for women. Um, but it's not as sweet as like Burberry Brit Sheer. It's just a different smell. I think it's like if you like Burberry, it's a great addition to your collection. And yeah, I really like it. 